Hello, my name is Aaron from Pitsco Education. In this video, we'll continue our exploration of the Fable programming software by diving into loops. If you watched our first part of our Getting Started tutorial series, then you've already seen how to download the Fable software and create a basic program containing two move blocks and a wait block. I'm going to pick up where I left off on my previous program. From the file icon, I choose Open Project and find my saved project. Remember that this program tells the joint module to go to 60 degrees on the X servo, wait, and then return to its starting position. Now, I want to make these commands repeat. So to do this, I'll need to insert a loop, which is located in the Loops tab. For this program, I need to drag a repeat while true block into the programming area. I can position my loop around the other blocks by making the blocks line up like a puzzle. When the lower block turns orange at the top, I let go, and the loop block goes around the other programming blocks. Now I have a program that moves the X servo to 60 degrees, waits one second, and then moves back to zero before it restarts the loop. However, now I have the same problem I had in the last video. I'm asking the robot to be at zero degrees and at 60 degrees at nearly the same time, and that's just not possible. So to correct this, I need to insert another wait block. But this time, instead of using the tabs, I can just right click on the first wait block and duplicate it to make a copy. Then I can put this wait block down at the bottom of my loop. This time, I'll change the parameter to three seconds. Let's see if it works. Looks great. So this concludes the second of our Fable Getting Started tutorials. You'll find the rest of our tutorial series at pitsco.com slash fable.